Three, two, one, do it. Deep breath in, big breath out, feeling warmer, more snuggly, more soothed, more relaxed. Hi Nat, how are you? Hello. How are you today? Good, thank you. What have you been up to lately? You name it. <laughs> oh my god, I'm like half dead. Are you? So many shoots? Yeah. Where have you been? Germany, just got back at midnight last night. In the typical week, how many countries do you find yourself in? <laughs> two. Just two. It's not terrible. Um, and uh, you've been hypnotised again? Yes. Because it's so relaxing. Yeah, it is actually, yeah. But I just hope it doesn't make me too relaxed. Because I remember leaving your place having to drive. And obviously I've got to drive after this and being a bit... Oh. No, so. I will always make sure that you're not too... Or before you go, because um, yeah, that's not that's not health and safety. You've got to be health and safety conscious. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, what do you like about being hypnotised? I think I do like the, like the relaxation, and it's funny, and it's relaxing. Yeah, fun. Yeah, fun and relaxing. Do you like finding weird things happening to you as well? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I mean. Yeah, it's funny, like fun that side. That weird fun. things, funny, different. Yeah, it's a bit crazy, mm -hmm. but as well as like relaxing in between. It's, it's. I mean, it's all good when everything goes to plan, mm -hmm. like shh, 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 shh. But when like, like this morning, I was supposed to get up at 20 past six and I got up at 20 past seven. And that is like a major difference. I was up at seven, walking the dog. Didn't bring the dog today. I think, I think she'd be a bit of an attention whore. And uh, that's, that's your job for today. Uh, yes. Okay, are you ready? to be hypnotised, mind controlled and made into my plaything once more. Can I just have a sip of my drink? Yes! I think I'd be cool now. I noticed that you've changed into your, your fluffy unicorn slippers, are you? They're mm. new. Are you more comfortable in them? Yeah. Well in that case, it's, it's ideal really. Okay, sit back. Um, open your eyes to begin with. Focus on the spot and ceiling. There's just no strength there, find that you just can't do it, can't persuade it to move. Just like you're a puppet, so then. As it drops down, you drop deeper and deeper and deeper and sleep. Rigid now. And you don't know what's happening, you don't know if you're still poseable like a doll, if you're still floppy and limp, can't tell. You feel detached, like this body isn't even yours. Like you're somewhere else. Trample them apart, but the more that you try, the more fixed they grow now. Trying to pull, but they're fixed, they're bound, they're locked. The more you try, the more helpless you feel, but it's a good, kind of sexy kind of helplessness. The more that feeling increases. 
more the feeling increases, it makes you feel sexy and detached and peaceful and the snap of my fingers sends you deep and makes you arrive three, two, one, sleep. As I count, three, two, one, wide awake. Wide awake, feeling good. And um, oh. yeah, looking very, looking very glamorous today. What the fuck? Hmm? <laughs> you seen what I've got on my feet? Oh, those. Yeah, they're really... Um, oh my God. They're really, like, they're really something. Where are my heels gone? Your heels are just over there. Oh. Well, shall I put them on? Yeah, if you, if you like. If you I'll prefer. Obviously, they're like much better. You think so? I need to go. <laughs> I can't get them off. You can't get them off. They're actually stuck. Are they? Like, really, really try, really pull, really fight. Fucking, it's really stuck. It's really stuck, and it's really annoying, and they seem very smug. They seem to be smirking at you. Mm, oh my god. It feels like your feet, like your slippers are taking the piss out of you. What the f- What are you doing? I don't know. <laughs> I can't even control my feet here. I didn't know you were such a gifted dancer. I'm not. This isn't how I dance. Is it not? This is stupid. They're like just doing their own things. But at least they're friends. It's like, you know, I mean, what the fuck? Imagine if they had an argument. Imagine if they wanted to go their separate ways. Oh my god, this is just like crazy. Oh, they really, they really fancy each other now. They really the fancy fuck? each other. They want to kiss. Oh. Oh, that's sweet. <laughs> that's so sweet. Please, can I just take them off? My God, no, I just want my... No, I'm sorry, they're feeling too raunchy. They want to make sweet love with one another. Now, what are you doing? I'm not doing anything. I'm, I, I, I'm really not. Very good. Now what you find is that every snap of my fingers causes your body to smoothly and efficiently strike a new pose. Very, very good. Now what you find is one snap switches Natalia back on and she wonders what she's doing. The next snap switches Natalia off and makes the robot pose. I obey. Natalia wondering what on earth's going on. Three, two, one. What's going on? Uh, you were just being a robot for me, striking different poses. Really? Do you not remember? Mm, no. Yeah, you were a robot. You were just uh, posing around. freeze. What's going on? What's going on is, is you want to sit and get comfy, but for some reason you keep finding yourself striking these weird poses. What do you mean weird poses? What for picture? And freeze. One snap brings you back, the next snap makes you pose and freeze. Comes back. What do you mean like for pictures? Pose and freeze. Just a plastic mannequin. The brain is dull. Try moving, thinking, speaking, anything. You just feel more brainless by the second. Brainless, enchanted, poseable, empty, calm.
these fingers remain bound in place as Natalia returns fully to normal but finds those fingers bound in place. Three, two, one. What's going on? I can't move my fingers. They're stuck in my eyelashes. Are they? What have you done to me? Cross your eyes, looking upwards, sticking your tongue out. Very good. Every time I say derp, you do that expression. And when I say release, you go back to whatever mode you were in previously. Back to being a wife, release. Derp. Release. So, what would you like for dinner tonight, darling? Derp. Release, emotionless robot now. Very, very good. Now, if this video's a little shorter than usual, I do apologise, but Natalia insisted on throwing all her clothes around, and we don't really tolerate that kind of behaviour in these parts. It's also because we followed up our hypnosis shoot with a live hypno stream with a YouTube audience, once we could get the damned technology working. It's totally free, and you can view that here. Sponsored by my patrons, who get themselves a wonderful set of perks like image sets, extended previews, full videos each month, and spicier previews than YouTube allows. Don't you chaps, I'm in your debt.